Good morning. Well, at least it is now. It's going to be a hot one today. Um, after being only 82 degrees yesterday, we're going to hit 98 today. Uh, I've been working on my sidewalks and uh, gluing them in place. Um, at least here, this is glued in place. Oh, looks like the polar bear is waiting to go into the john, isn't he? <clears throat> and I got all these over here. They're all glued together, um, except for where the buildings match up to them. They're not glued to the building sidewalks. Uh, I mean, it's not glued to the uh, diner or to the uh, the cement or the uh, the roadway yet. <clears throat> I may not, I may leave them loose so that I can pick them up for cleaning. I do have to do some vacuuming because uh, I had to lower this and I just got a little bit of a bump. I'm going to have to take that out when I put in my uh, grade crossing. I'm going to put two re-railer tracks in here. Um, because I don't have any place that's easy to re-rail my stuff and I'm getting old and I can't really see it. So my re-railers will go there. <clears throat> so I'm probably going to have to uh, fix the hump. And then over here I'll, I'll have to break down and put in uh, um, some sort of a road. Maybe just paint it gray and leave it at that. I don't know yet. So that's what I've been doing this morning. I got fire hydrants I'm going to put in and uh, manhole covers. I got to paint the grates. I got some already painted and I've got more to paint and put in. So uh, the, the town's really starting to look good. I got to do some more work on spreckles. Um, start getting it finished up and the rail yard I got a makeshift uh, workbench over here since the uh, uh, cars in the garage I can't move it till it's fixed so it's kind of in my way but I found a place to put my table and nice work area, got fresh air, so when I'm using this tester's glue, they, I'm at least in a ventilated area. But I got the superlanders out, and uh, along with the amp fleet. Uh, that's it for now. I'll probably run trains again later. You'll uh, get to watch the tunnel motor down there with the Kodachrome and the uh, my flashing lights on the uh, Bachman Spectrum uh, F40PH. So uh, for now, it's Randy J saying I'll see you on the flip side. It's kind of funny. I just put in uh, a couple of fire hydrants today, and then uh, David Reed had sent me a fire truck. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Thank you, David. Much appreciated, and it's already going to work. All right, see you on the flip side. Okay, it's Tuesday. Polar bear is still trying to sneak into the uh, Port of Killian, Port of John. And again, there's a fire truck I got from uh, David Reed. And uh, I hear the beast coming up, so I'm going to have to help the wife unload the truck. I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. Uh, a few things I had to glue down, like, like the mailbox here. It was, uh, it sits on, uh, sits on three legs. One of them got broke. Um, I think I had to glue this. This no, nope, he's not glued. Okay, well, I thought I glued it, but because it's on three legs as well. Um, 
I don't know whether I showed you the fire hydrant. <laughs> okay, that's a good one, Randy J. You put your damn fire hydrant in upside down. Oh, my God. God, what a stupid person. Oh, well. Yeah, the joke's on the poor fireman. That's a funny one there. Okay, let me see what else is going on over here. Uh, I moved around these guys here. They decided to be sociable. Instead of hanging out by the caboose, they're over here uh, watching the trains from their campsite. Oh, the girls have snuck out of their tents. Wow. Okay. Oh, and these guys decided to come back from the beach. Okay. And that's about it. I did some track cleaning today. It's a club meeting night. Um, we always meet the second Tuesday of the month. Um, so I have a train out for somebody to run if they want to run it with their locomotive or I'll just bring one of mine out. In the meantime, I've got the Pepsi can running the uh, Amtrak uh, Amfleet with the Horizon uh, snack bar, car, dinette, whatever you call it. And uh, that's what's going on here. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you on the flip side. These two uh, black tanks at one time was a uh, toilet paper core. So uh, now I got two tanks. See on the flip side. Well, with the success of the uh, small tanks over there, I can uh, use the bandsaw this time and make sure the cuts are straight. Because if you notice, uh, they're leaning a little bit, which I can figure that out and make it work. But I can run this through here and make a straight cut. And I have a problem. So this is probably going to be some sort of tank or multiple tanks. Okay, see you on the flip side. Once again, the uh, fire department's trying to figure out why the hydrant's upside down. Did somebody pull some sort of a prank on them or something? Well, anyway, speaking of fire hydrants, I have four more. <clears throat> I'll find a good home for him. I have plenty of corners. And I can honestly tell you that fire hydrant is going to see us on the flip side. I took some, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, white chalk and uh, Put some lines down here just to see how it's going to look. Looks like I'm going to have to rethink it probably. But uh, I don't know. What do you guys think? <clears throat> oh, and... Uh, Notice something's missing, huh? The focus is out in the out in the uh, driveway now. <clears throat> Here's a little culprit that went bad. Sensor. So, uh, of course, that's the, we all know what that is. So. <clears throat> But they had to replace the whole thing in order to just get the car back up and running. So that's the way it goes. Newfangled electronic stuff. So Pixie and I are going to see you on the flip side. I'm going to try to get this video out uh, Saturday or Sunday. Uh, I'm having computer issues and I had to restart my computer from scratch yesterday with the Windows disk and everything. It can be a pain in the rear end. That computer is so old that uh, 
I need to uh, get a new one, hopefully for my birthday, which is coming up in uh, another month or so. And that's it for now. I think I will uh, see you guys all on the flip side. Rainy J signing off. And Pixie. I'm David Reed. Got a hazmat response vehicle and the forklift. And, uh, pretty neat. Definitely put these things to work. Definitely will put them to work. Thank you, David. Thank you all for watching my videos. And I will see you all on the flip side. Randy J signing off. That is a hazmat situation. I hope you all agree. That's pretty funny right there. Pretty funny. Okay, see you on the flip side. I uh, had to clean the wheels or the gears underneath the um, turntable because it was uh, jumping and hopping like a bunny rabbit and uh, a lot of dog hair in there so I'm gonna have to pay a little more attention to the maintenance of the turntable <clears throat> but uh, that's part of having a dog and you lay out in the garage where it's dusty and dirty I guess huh <clears throat> So I think I'm going to go put this video up and stick it on YouTube. Let you guys watch it. So, Randy J. And we're going to whistle off. And I'll see you on the flip side.